Hi, my name's Adam. I'm going to be taking you through this week's questions and answer session from us here at Anova Systems. Thanks for watching. In this week's video, I've been asked how I can find my drawing if all I've got is the part model. You see in this example that I've got open here, that over on the left hand side, I can actually right click to open drawing. But that's not always successful. It will just come up uh, and it will pop up your open menu and you'll be able to browse through your machine. What you can do is you can go to the folder where you've got the, the part saved. The general rule is that the part model has no idea there's a drawing created from it. If the items have exactly the same name then you'll be able to do what I just did in the part model there and open up the drawing. So if I change the name of this file okay now when I go open drawing it opens the drawing for me and it finds it correctly. Okay, however, that's not always the case. You don't always find that your part model has got the same name as your drawing. What you can do instead, if you go to it in Windows and find your part model, you can right click and you'll find SolidWorks options on the right click menu. These are the options from SolidWorks Explorer. Uh, and if you choose any one of these, probably rename is a, a good example. What it will do is it will search for your machine for any references. Okay, and this works the same if you created an assembly and you want to find the assembly that's associated with a cert certain part model. The relationship will always go uh, down in one direction, so it will go from the assembly or from the drawing to the part, but not the other way. Okay, so if you want to find your your drawing from the part model you can use this rename option and it will do a search of your machine. Thanks very much for watching.